fire. Earth. Air. Water. Will that be cute? <gasps> that would be cute. Gonna die someday, rather be alive today. You've been on my mind today. Got some shit that I should say. And this is what this song's about. Moving back. Told you I had more sweater vest coming. Oh, oh! Do you like it? I turned some lights on because I feel like I have to do a lot of making up for the fact that I don't have white walls and fluorescent lighting. I feel like it makes my videos less appealing to people. It's sad. But anyway, we're continuing. I love how I'm just like taking them out and I'm like, here, look. Okay, this one I probably should have gotten in a smaller size. That's... We'll try it on. Mm. Okay, it's not that bad, actually. It's smaller on. I mean... Probably when I wash it and dry it, it'll shrink. Oh, that's, yeah, that's small. This one looks a lot like that other green one that I had. That's okay, because I love green. Oh, it is cute. Okay. I might just actually put this one, it needs to be dried. I guess I thought I had a lot, but I don't. Let's try it on. Ooh. Schmerzing. Okay, wait, I actually... I like this one. This might be my favorite. I feel like I'm always coughing in your face, I'm sorry. Are you guys seeing this? Well, what do I think? Was that ugly? It probably was. You want me to try the other ones on, or what? Okay. <laughs> Ew. Okay. good to me. Wait, let me move this light over here. I gave it like an 8 or 9. Yeah. Oh my god! Is it cute? Aww. I love it. I love this one. Oh my god, my stomach hurts. I'm eating tuna. Don't judge me.
I feel like my lips have been crusty today, so I was trying to spare you from... <sighs> having to look at them crusty. <clears throat> Sorry. I'll cut that out. I was looking for... A brown belt to go with like the blue pants that I just got from ASOS and this is what I found instead at Express so I'm really excited and we're gonna have to put it together so we can see what it's gonna look like but literally you know that something is a good purchase when you literally wear it like the next second like I put this on at the store. And I'm not ashamed. Because it's very cute. Oh. I also got this. I don't know how I feel about it yet. It's from H&M. I don't really shop there very often. They do have some cool stuff. But yeah, so I need to put this with something. I got the medium. So it was like on like super sale. It was like on so look. It was on sale for eleven dollars. And I wanted it before it was on sale. And the medium is the smallest size that they have, so I'm gonna have to make it work. But I love fleece, so that's why I got it. Anyway. That'd be cute. Oh, that would be cute. We've got to work, work, work this and make right the sun. Okay, I'm done. Okay, but actually. about to be stalling. Stalling. Okay, I have a little conversation in bed. Damn it. We're gonna... <laughs> Conversations in bed. Class isn't about, like class as in classiness, isn't about how you look, what you wear, or don't wear. It's about who you are and how you act. Because if we're saying that someone who wears less clothes is, is not classy um, and should not be respected as such, then that's kind of like saying like that you shouldn't respect someone when they're naked. You know? I don't know, maybe that made more sense in my head. I don't think I explained it very Feel free to discuss in the comments. Cause I don't I don't think I fleshed it out. It's it's 204 AM. And I have to be up early tomorrow. But I wanted to finish this vlog on something like a little more meaningful because I didn't talk about anything like meaningful today. 
and I really like to add that kind of stuff to like all of my content like I don't just want it to be about things you know yeah but yeah I was um I was explaining to my mom uh, that, that classy isn't just about like covering up and I even referenced um, if you've seen the J-Lo what's that called? the J-Lo thing on Netflix I'll put it up here on the screen J-Lo put it really nicely in her Netflix film that um, you can still be like that there's nothing wrong with like being sexy I guess um, like that you should you can still be or should still be respected even when you're sexy and like there's nothing wrong with that being a part of like your personality or your look and it was something that I related to like on a whole other level because I I don't feel like I try to like look or be sexy like I I really have a lot more of like a masculine um like badass tomboy thing that I go for and like I don't know but her saying that like it's okay to be sexy like that there's nothing wrong with it um I don't know, like, made me feel better because I feel like sometimes people perceive me as sexy or as trying to be sexy when I'm, like, completely not, and, like, they make it seem like it's a bad thing. So that was kind of the first time that I'd ever heard of, like, sexy actually being, like, a good thing and, like, someone talking about, like it's still being a respectful thing. Um, <clears throat> and when I was talking to my mom about it, I was saying, like, um, so when JLo wore her, you know, signature green dress, even though she was showing lots of skin and she had lots of curves and she was very, very sexy in that dress, was she not still classy? You know? Yeah. I, I think that we are... Like, our generations are moving more towards... Um, respecting, like... Bodies, but, like, in a, in a bigger sense, like respecting like like really kind of the idea of respecting someone whether they're naked or they're fully clothed or they have different beliefs like I feel like we are moving towards that yeah like I think um, watching, what was I thinking of? Um, so like, watching movies, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about Euphoria, I think, but, and this is just like my own perception, like, I don't actually know how other people took this. Oh, and actually Game of Thrones. So I feel like with, with the two of those, with Euphoria and Game of Thrones having, both having a lot of nudity, uh, despite them having a lot of nudity, I felt like the actors, um, when people talked about those shows, they still had a lot of respect for those actors. Like, the actors didn't lose respect just because 
they were nude in a scene. And I think that that is like really great, really beautiful, but I, I think that, that is new. I don't think that actors were always respected by, you know what I mean, like by audiences for being nude. I don't, that is a real, that's a real like conversation starter. I might have to do like a longer video on something like that, but I really do have to get to bed. And I just, I wanted to finish this vlog on a good note and that makes me happy that this is like how we're finishing it. I feel like this was like a good, a good conversation. But yeah, so that's it for our little conversations in bed sesh. My camera doesn't tell me, like, how long it's been recording. Does it? It definitely does, and this is the first time that I'm finding out. So this talk was like 10 minutes long. Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna see how much we can... You know... Alright, good night guys, see you in the morning. Yeah, so I'm gonna end the vlog here.